Breaking news. Our hearts sink when we hear those words. Often it means that something has gone terribly wrong. War has broken out. A natural disaster has occurred. Maybe a deadly epidemic. Breaking news. Why is breaking news always bad news? When we have good news, we call those closest to us. We call our friends or our family or our loved ones and say, Hey, I, I got the job or I got a promotion or we're getting married or we're having a baby. Good news spreads personally, but breaking news seems to always be bad. How good would good news have to be for good news to be breaking news? There was a Roman emperor named Caesar Augustus. He ruled the world when Jesus arrived. And they called his birth, Euangelion, Gospel, Good News. And they spoke of it as good news because it was during his reign that the Pax Romana came about, the great peace throughout the Roman Empire. And so the people called him the Son of God, the Savior of mankind. In their own form of emperor worship, people would begin to speak of Caesar as the one who brought salvation and freedom and justice and peace. Surely his birth was good news. But there was another baby, Jesus, who came, born in Bethlehem, the city of David, Israel's greatest king. Jesus in this lowly little town. Jesus, the one who was God himself see, when Caesar was born, it was only good news for certain people, for Roman citizens. But for the ones who Rome had conquered, and for the ones who were oppressed and kept down by Rome, Caesar's birth wasn't good news. And this was just more propaganda, more spin from the empire. But Jesus, this was different. This was a king whose birth was good news for learned men and lowly shepherds. This was a savior who had come for the downtrodden and the despairing. This was a king who understood the complexity of things, who knows that we are not only the wronged, but the wrongdoer, not simply the ones in need of saving, but truthfully, the ones in need of judging. This was a king who came to do both, to rescue us by taking on himself our own judgment. This was a king who rescues all of us. His birth truly is good news. Breaking news, the heavens broke open, the skies were filled with songs, the angels proclaimed the headlines that night. Behold, I bring you good news and exceedingly great joy for all people. This day is born in Bethlehem, the Savior, the Lord. Think of this for you. How is Jesus good news for you? God who's come near, the God who hears you, the God who knows your pain and your prayer, the God who's come to take it all on himself and carry the weight of it for you, the God who saves by taking the judgment on himself. When God comes near, there is good news.